everyone. So I have recently discovered a new pet peeve of mine, flies. It turns out that it takes a long time to animate these videos, so I have been sitting in one place for longer than I normally do. This leaves me open for the annoyance that is flies. I had no problem with flies before this. I would just think, oh, a fly, that's annoying, whatever. But now, <laughs> the most annoying part of them is that they land on me and walk around and crap, usually right when I'm super focused on finishing an animation or something. So my natural reaction is, of course, to end their existence by hitting them. But guess what? Flies have these awesome ninja dodging skills. Okay, and can we just talk for a second about what flies get out of this exchange? Like, mosquitoes land on you to suck your blood, and even though that's annoying and itchy, they actually have a purpose. Also, horseflies, same thing. They get a tasty chunk of skin out of the exchange. So while I also hate them, it at least makes sense. But flies, flies don't make sense. Oh my gosh, it's so annoying. Do they feed on anger or something? Because otherwise you have no reason to land on me. I mean, they're just like, duh, 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 gonna land on this guy and annoy him for no reason. Fun fact, one time we were on a family road trip, and one of our two dogs at the time noticed that there was a fly in the car. It flew by our old dog, Duke, and chomp, he ate the fly right out of the air. If I was a fly, that's how I would want to go down. I'd be all like, okay, I'm going in. I'm going to try and annoy this huge pit bull for no reason. It will be legendary. Then comes the darkness. And there's always that one fly that flies around your head and keeps landing on you and uses its super ninja dodging ability to avoid getting hit. So I had been on the computer, and it landed on me for what had to have been the 50th time that day. That was the last straw. I went and got a fly swatter and walked into the office and closed the doors, blocking off its escape path. And I literally said out loud, It's just you and me, fly. You don't get to live anymore. And the hunt began. I saw it on the table, and before I even swung, it started flying again. I was following it with my eyes, but it crossed over one of the many black things in the office, and I lost sight of it. Because you can see it when the background is a light color, but not when the background is dark. So I stood still, waiting for my eyes to catch any signs of movement. Then I felt it land on my arm and start crawling around. I felt it with its stupid idiot dumb feet. It's taunting me! I tried to smack it, but it flew away and onto a chair. I held up the fly swatter. Oh, and by the way, if you're a creature and people invent a tool designed specifically to kill you, then that's a really clear sign that you're annoying and stupid and you shouldn't exist. Anyways, I held up the fly swatter and... Ha! I destroyed it! Also, there were like three flies between the window and the blinds, and I killed all of them as well. Yes! Human's position at the top of the ecological chain preserved. You are welcome. Okay, I'm not done yet. Another thing that makes me angry is just the sound they make. Just the stupid bzzz, and then they run into a wall and it's like bzzz, 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 bzzz. Ugh, I kid you not, that sound now gives me anxiety. Honestly, that could be a good torture method. Tie someone to a chair and put them in a room filled with thousands of flies. And they can't move and they just have to sit there and let the stupid flies crawl all over them. If someone used that torture method on me, I would last 10 minutes tops. Okay, I'll tell you where the secret base is. Just please get me away from these flies. <laughs> so the moral of the story is, flies are stupid. Literally, their only purpose is to fly around poop and be eaten by other cool bugs, like spiders. Spiders are super scary and I totally scream every time I see one, but they're actually pretty cool. And spiders are also great because they murder flies. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hold on, don't end the video. Literally, as I was animating this, my brother Brony, knowing full well about the fly's ninja dodging skills, decided to one-up the flies with superior human intelligence. He saw a fly on the wall, and knowing that this fly would zip away as soon as he saw movement, decided to play right into this. He carefully placed himself behind the fly, and intentionally clapped about a foot behind the fly. The fly, seeing the movement, got scared, and immediately flew off the wall directly into the clap. What bam the fly caught the full force of the clap directly in the face and died immediately, slowly spinning to the ground. Take that, flies! Okay, bye, everyone. Hey, guys. Uh, sorry this video took a while to get out. I had a lot of stuff going on, and also school's starting now. <laughs> but anyways, we've almost, like, doubled in subscribers. We've got, like, 730 now. I'm so appreciative to everyone who subscribed, and thank you guys for all the support and the nice comments. I'm really flattered. Well, until next time, friends, I'll see you later.